Do you never intend to give a public answer, Your Grace? What have I been asked? About the mages. You could calm this fire if you stepped forward. The Chantry's teachings are clear. Those who turn against them would not listen more to me than to Andraste. Then you do favor the Templars, Your Grace. I favor peace, which is not the goal of either side, I'm afraid. I did not expect things to deteriorate so fast. I thought after the Canari, no one would wish for more violence. It has drawn more attention than I would like. Sebastian, if I can ask... Anything, Your Grace. And the Champion, too, if you will. I can't imagine any way this will go wrong. What would you have of us? The Divine is concerned about the situation here. She does not want to see the Free Marches become another Imperium. She has sent an agent to assess the danger. Meet with her, please. Tell her drastic measures won't be required. I don't want to see the Divine's armies march against Kirkwall. Could we keep the Exalted marching to a minimum? I keep all my stuff in Kirkwall. Surely the Divine wouldn't treat the whole city as enemies. She is concerned. It is never wise to draw the concern of the powerful. She is the voice of Andraste. She cannot turn the might of the Chantry against the innocent due to proximity. Were no innocents harmed in the Exalted Marches? She will do her best, Sebastian. But she must act first to protect the Faith. What can you tell me about this Servant of the Divine? I was not told her real name. Only to call her Sister Nightingale. She is said to be the Divine's left hand. Sent to do work that might blacken the Divine's name. What argument would convince her? The Divine has heard my protests already. I must trust your own powers of persuasion now. This cannot wait. Thank you. We cannot allow this ridiculous mage rebellion to turn into holy war. The agent, Sister Nightingale, will be waiting in the Viscount's throne room tonight. She wishes to remain unseen. The room has been sealed since the Canari incident. It may be difficult to get in without attracting attention. Oh man, shit is getting getting rough here. So, uh, got Varric and Sebastian friendship. Oh, a lot of Sebastian friendship out of that one. Twenty-five. Jeez. Sebastian is probably one of the most. Have many dealings with the Knight Commander. Please don't start with that. I'm not a Templar. I'm the captain of the guard. We arrest burglars. The Knight Commander never gives us a thought. Grand Cleric Elthina is worried about her. She's stopped taking the Chantry's advice. Her job's not easy. Certain forces in the city are allied against her. Clearly, our Templars need strong leaders. Until something changes, that's Meredith. And we must give her any support we are able. Sebastian is, of course, going to take the side of the Templars. If for nothing more than his... Oh, shit. Ah, figures. What hell's this?
I, uh, <laughs> I guess this isn't who we were supposed to meet here. Let's do some killing. Wow, there's a lot of action going on. Oh, Hawk is down. Shit. Who's still up? Two apostates of rage. Some corpses. I think the blood mage might be out. Oh, nope. She's still up. Alright, the blood mage is down. I'm not going to make it. Let's try this again. now she should kill the spies let's do this a little bit smarter All right, the apostates are going out. How did everyone else fall? What the fuck happened? Oh, come on. Did much better this time. The resolutionists. I might have known they would be part of this. Oh, it's Liliana. Are you Sister Nightingale? I am. Or you may call me Liliana. The Divine sent me to investigate the possibility of a rebellion here, in Kirkwall. Without informing the guards, of course. This is an unconventional situation. I... have some experience with those. Do you seriously not remember her? THE Leliana? Who accompanied the hero of Ferelden to slay the Archdemon? Ah... I see it will be harder to remain anonymous so near the Ferelden border. Yes, I knew the hero of Ferelden. He is dear to my heart. I am working for the Divine now, in Orle. I had not thought to return to this part of Thedas. Who are the Resolutionists? An offshoot of a fraternity within the Circle of Magi. There have always been factions that support freedom from the Chantry, and the abolition of the circle. We have tolerated them, 
But the resolutionists have become violent. They are likely behind the unrest here. I hardly imagined the divine secret agent looking like you. That is why I am effective. The divine has long suspected that Kirkwall's problems were spurred by an outside group. This attack proves she is right. Are you saying you set this whole thing up? I let word slip that an agent of the Divine was coming to investigate the mage troubles. It is how they chose to react which condemns them. Will the Divine send soldiers? Divine Justinia takes the situation here very seriously. She believes it is the worst threat to Thedas since the Cunara invaded. A handful of apostates? How can that possibly... <laughs> the whole world is watching Kirkwall. If it falls to magic, none of us are safe. Tell Elthina to leave. There is refuge for her at the Grand Cathedral in Orlais. She will not be safe here. These mages are out of control. Ooh, that's bad. <laughs> that is not good. Okay, from what Liliana seems to have picked up here, is that the situation is actually a little bit worse than we were probably expecting. There are a group of people from outside of Kirkwall who are manipulating the events in order to... Um, upset the mage rebellion and the whole world seems to be watching if the mages rebel here then mages other places may rebel as well and Liliana seems to <sighs> seems to have said that if uh, that it's possible that she, she implied that there will be an invasion to put the Mage Rebellion to rest. Which, you know, is bad. Okay, we gotta go back to the Chantry and tell the, um... Ah, shit. I gotta actually run there. <laughs> Where is that at, anyway? Alright. You're too quiet, Varric. I'm thinking of switching to romances. Uh, nothing? Not even a foreboding frown? I am content. Write what you will. Well, that certainly takes the fun out of it. Contentment in the barracks? Who'll pay to hear that shit? Then I should have thought of it years ago. <laughs> Good day to you. And Rastate had say, those who harm the house of the Maker have done harm unto the Maker himself. Uh, I have got some bad news. I've known you for three years now. I give up. You beat me. What is it? You like boys, sheep, you slept with your sister. What are you talking about? What are you hiding? Nobody's this bloody clean. After you leave the Chantry, you get drunk at the Hangman and walk around in women's clothes. I've been honest with you and Hawk. Liar. Lying is a sin. Yeah. <laughs> what would you say to an exciting trip to Orlais? I hear the Grand Cathedral's lovely this time of year. What? You were right. The Divine will be taking action against Kirkwall, though the sister didn't say what. You must take the holy relics from the Chantry and leave for safety. Sebastian, I'm surprised at you. Andraste would not thank me for saving a few dusty finger bones and my own skin at the cost of people's lives. You do no one any good if you're dead. When I became Grand Cleric, I took a vow to the people of Kirkwall and the Free Marches. 
I will not leave my flock. Would you let yourself die? There is no greater devotion than to lay one's life at the Maker's feet. There is no better death than to take the blow for another. You don't hear that one quoted often, do you? Please, Your Grace. Sister Nightingale thinks there will be war. Then, I must make peace. Settle yourself, Sebastian. I'm in no personal danger. I am Grand Cleric. Who would dare attack me? If you will not shield yourself, then I will be your shield. You will come through this safely by the Maker's name. I swear it. Okay, so shit's gonna hit the fan pretty freaking, pretty freaking hard soon. All of the events that we've seen in this game leading up to this point are finally starting to come to their uh, conclusion here. Jeez, what are these twins? Look at that shit. They're not even talking to each other. The only difference is their hair. Not even that different. They're just different color. What the freaking hell. 